friends, I got Ari with me today. You may have seen this handsome young man in some other videos where we talk automation. I'm gonna get straight to the point today, which is American built and also job shop, high mix, low volume. The very first question that Ari brought up to me that we wanna to discuss today is, if I have a 20 piece job, a 10 piece job, why the heck would I automate it? Ari, what's the answer to that question? It's a great question. We get this all the time from many of our customers, uh, new customers really, but um, historically automation, especially uh, more uh, high volume automation has been um, really difficult to change over, time consuming to change over. But these automation solutions that we have with automation within reach, um, they are very simplistic to change over. The uh, templates are, are self-contained or, or adjust, even adjustable. Um, the part contact tooling is all adjustable. Uh, um, the programming is all conversational, so it takes five minutes to change over from job to job um, and run. So people are utilizing even smaller batch sizes with a robot from Automation Within Reach uh, to uh, really amortize their operators over multiple other jobs, uh, utilizing their operators and their skilled operators for more intelligent tasks, right? Setting up a new job, doing tool life, doing chip control, quoting a new job, right? And allowing the robot to uh, really do the simple task of unloading and loading the machine. A so. powerfully conveyed message, Ari. It really is. The audience watching, I'm sure, goes, five minutes. Can it be real? But it is real. I've actually been to Alabama with one of your customers who won't even bid on a job anymore right. unless they can automate it. And they can, thanks to technology like this. And automation within reach is two things. One, a company. And two, it's also working in that word, in that sentence as automation is within reach. Now, I want to amplify one other point of this that I think is extremely important, especially because here in the U.S., we're reshoring a ton and yes. we want to do more American made stuff. This yes. is all made in America, isn't it? Yes, absolutely. Actually, our... Uh, um, engineering team here in Dayton, Ohio has designed all, each one of these units. Um, we've uh, programmed it. We don't contract that out. We do everything in-house here. Uh, we have an assembly facility here on site in Day downtown Dayton, Ohio, where we put everything together. Um, you know, so we have an assembly line for each one of these units. We were able to crank out about 20 units a month um, right now. So um, yeah, they are designed, built, service supported all out of the United States, uh, really honing in on the origin of Dayton, Ohio. So Service and support. It's like we've done this before, Ari. You know exactly how to lead me into my next question. Let's talk about service and support yeah. now. Yeah, so we have the largest installation network in the United States. We have over 300 uh, units already in the United States since 2018. We did unveil these units at IMTS 2018. Uh, we've continued to uh, increase our unit um, catalog, right? Um, but uh, we work with the Morris Group. We work with the Hartwig Group, um, obviously Goskers, uh, machine tool distributors. Uh, but we have the largest sales and service network. We have service techs from all over the country that come here for specific RCDC, uh, VBX, RCX type training so that they can so service and support these units long term for the customer and locally. I like that you say that, and I'm going to bring up something that I think is important based on that topic, and you can fix all the errors where I'm wrong, right? Okay. But talking with the audience, there's a lot of folks out there right now, especially a lot of job shops who firstly maybe didn't understand how quickly that you can switch over a job, so high mix, low volume. You can do 10, 20, 30 parts and automate, which is important. As Ari said, getting your skilled workers to do other things. However, Talking about service and support, Ari, it's also very important. There's a large number of folks out there who are still a little bit hesitant at automation. So if they, if Ari and his team at Gossager had the largest support system in the entire country, it at least can help remove, possibly over time, because it takes its, us time a little bit, but help remove that that hesitation, that potential fear of implementing our first automation cell, our second automation cell, because you guys are going to back them up and yes. make sure they're taken care of. Was any of that correct? Was all yeah. of that correct? Yeah. I do, all right? Absolutely. That was great. Yeah. Well, the, the nice thing about Gosker, right, we're not just trying to sell a robot arm. We're not just trying to sell one solution, right? We're really, we're solution sellers, right? On my shirt sleeve, it says serious solutions. We Can take you that, flex it for we me? Take, there we it take is. that seriously, <laughs> right? Um, whether it's a standard piece of automation, 
in, right, with a, like you see behind me here, or whether it's a Cobot solution, whether it's a modified load and go, whether it's a full blown custom solution, we're really looking and in, in, uh, trying to understand the customer's manufacturing philosophy and the uh, and you know, really what they're trying to overcome and achieve in, in their automation endeavor, right? And we're trying to make sure that we focus on providing them the best possible solution for their manufacturing philosophy and their, their uh, facility. I can't say it better. I'm not even going to try. However, what I will say is, yes, we're standing in front of a turning center from Akuma right now, but Ari and I are going to have more videos on exceptional sales and custom sales just for you as well, just to show you what you can get done. So if you haven't seen those videos, check those out as well. They're definitely going to be coming. And uh, yeah, nothing more to say, Ari. You've done an amazing job. Can I keep you with me all the time? Absolutely. I like it. All right, guys, we'll see you. Thank you so much for your time. We know how important and precious time can be and we appreciate you watching the channel Ari as always my friend you are flex it there it is yes yes there it is all right my friends thank you again see you all again soon thank you